Ron Hines coming back at you. Hey, so last night the DNC finished up. So somebody that no one voted for through the primary is going to be the nominee for the Democrat Party. And I guess that's fine. But that sure don't sound like promoting democracy. And number next, when Kamala accepted her, <coughs> excuse me, when Kamala accepted her uh, assignment as their uh, candidate, she said that inflation was down. Yesterday, I just told you, since 2021, to maintain your lifestyle, you needed $11,000 plus to do that in your disposable income. Well, that's $11,000 annually of inflation that's there. So it is down somewhat if you look at maybe gas prices at one time were three sixty a gallon, and now it's three twenty five. But that's kind of like saying, well, I aired my tire up to 35 PSI, and now I'm down to 34. It's not much of a change. But anyway, because right now, today, inflation is still up compared to where you were three and a half years ago. And that's all I'm saying about that. Hey, but look, enough about politics. You realize that, uh, you know, we need to be bigger people every day. Just bottom line, we got to be bigger people. So helping one person might not change the world. But helping that one person might change their world. So every day before I close off, I always tell you to go out and help somebody and be an angel. And that's what that goes back to. So anyway, this one's short and sweet. Not much of a rant. Uh, inflation's still up. But the old flag is still upside down. And part of that is because of this inflation. So anyway, when you go to your Lord and Savior in prayer today, be sure to lift up this once great nation. God knows we need it. And we need to turn back to God. And... Also, hey, quick thought here. Did you know we had 13 states on the original United States, right? We had 13 stars. And each one of those states have a, a, a constitution just like we have overall national constitution. And every one of those constitutions has an affirmation of faith in a Lord and Savior. Yeah, they were all Jesus, God-fearing men. Maybe that's what made this nation great. And the way our Constitution is written, it is written for a God-based society. So if we have more people that are not godly and based in Christianity, then that document doesn't work. Something to think about, huh? Anyway, be sure to like, subscribe, hit the bell. Sorry about the impromptu thing. It's just things I, that just, God, I guess God put that in my head, wanted me to tell you that. Did you know that, that 13 state constitutions had an, you, to, to swear an oath to the state, to work for the state, you had to swear that you were a Christian. Pretty cool. Yep. Well, I are one. Yep. Anyway, be sure to like, subscribe, hit the bell. We'll be coming at you soon with more stuff. God bless you all. Have a great day. Bye. Oh, don't forget to help somebody. Later.